The dynamic labeler tool allows you to label items in your model. Now you can either label them at the item level, which is right here, or you can label it at the group level, which is right there. To demonstrate this, I'm going to do the item level first. I'm going to select this one item here. I'm going to say, let's just label the single part. And there it comes up and it labels this. I've got tube three. And as you can see there, we can move this around. Um, it also gives you the ability to delete it, increase the font, decrease the font, and also reposition the endpoint. So if I really wanted the endpoint to be pointed right here, I could do that. I'm going to escape. I'm going to select another item. This time I'm going to label the group. So it should come up with this 400 PA in there. So I'm going to go group. And now you can see in there it's labeled that. And as you can see, I also added the word line number in front of it. So you can customize that also. And you can move your model around. So if I start to move the model around, you can see the labels stay. And what we normally would do here is you would probably turn around and create a viewpoint. And then you can clear the labels out so the labels will stay in the viewpoint.